Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how you can set up your workspace so you can start making your own bucket plugins. There are a few things you're going to need to download. The first is the Java JDK, the second is Git Bash, and the third is IntelliJ, or another IDE of your choice. I highly recommend IntelliJ though because their compiler is far superior to almost any IDE that currently exists. Let's get right into it. After you download the buildtools.jar from Spigot, you can go ahead and put it in a folder all by itself, then right click and do git bash here. And then here we're going to type in a nice little command. You don't really need to understand what it does, but it's going to be java-jar, and then the name of the jar, which is build tools. It's case sensitive, so make sure to remember that, dot jar. And then at the end, you can put a couple things. If you want to compile the craft bucket API, what you would do is do dash dash compile craft bucket just like so and it will compile the craft bucket but you will have to compile it a second time if you want the spigot one to also compile because it will only compile one jar at a time if you want to change the version you can do dash dash rev and put in the version right here that you want to download it does not matter what it is if you don't add any parameters it will download the latest stable spigot build which is listed where you download build tools. The most recent version is 1.16.4, so I'm just gonna go ahead and hit enter and I'm going to wait for this to build. All right, so as you can see, the program has finished running and we now have our spigot 1.16.4.jar file. Now you could go and download the spigot jar online, but doing it this way doesn't allow you to get the net minecraft server imports that you would want to use when making your plugin if you don't know what that is just know it will become very useful in your future of plugin development anyways guys that's how you set up your workspace you can go ahead and head on to the next video in this tutorial series where i'll show you how to set up your very first plugin i'll see you guys over there goodbye nice the mutt's nuts in fact